that is hippopotamus and they are on the verge of extinction the hippopotamus also known as the river horse lives along the rivers and lakes throughout sub saharan africa weighing up to 8000 pounds the hippo is the heaviest land animal after the elephant hippos seek refuge from the heat by living in water during the day and at night they come ashore to feed on short soft grasses and fallen fruits the eyes and ears of hippopotamus are on top of its head so it can keep watch for enemies mainly crocodiles while lying low in the water these giants are currently at risk from habitat loss The hippopotamus has a bulky body on a stumpy legs an enormous head a short tail and a four toes on each foot each toe has a nail like hoof males are usually 3.5 meters long stand 1.5 meters tall and weigh 3200 kg in terms of physical size males are the largest sex weighing roughly 30% more than females The skin is 5 cm thick on the flanks but thinner elsewhere and nearly hairless. Hippos are well adapted to aquatic life. The ears, eyes and nostrils are located high on the head so that the rest of the body may remain submerged. The ears and nostrils can be folded shut to keep out water. The body is so dense that hippos can walk underwater where they can hold their breath for 5 minutes. Hippos favor shallow areas where they can sleep half submerged. Their population are limited by this day living space which may become quite crowded. As many as 150 hippos may use one pool in the dry season. Hippos however eat relatively little vegetarian for their size as their energy requirement is low because they are floating in warm water much of the time Hippos do not chew cud but retain food for a long time in the stomach where protein is extracted by fermentation their digestive process cycles tremendous quantities of nutrient into the african rivers and lakes and thereby support the fish that are so crucial as a protein source in the diet of a local people hippos eventually reached europe and asia though climate change and over hunting by humans have exterminated all species outside africa by the end of 11700 years ago three species lived in madagascar until recent times their extinction may have coincided with the arrival of humans about thousands year ago 